Hey y'all, good morning. Ooh, y'all, I'm just now getting up. <laughs> I am just and now oh, waking up this morning, y'all. I don't know what it is, but your girl has zero energy and I don't never oh, get up this late. It is 10 o'clock, 10 a.m. on this Monday morning. I still didn't want to get out of my bed. I struggle to get out of my bed. You know when your bed is just so nice, warm, and cozy? Yep, that's what it was for me. <laughs> you know why when you have fresh, clean sheets on, it's just something about it, the way you sleep so good. But, <sighs> good morning, you all. It's Monday. Um, this is, like, this is still uh, Thanksgiving Day week. Oh, and by the way, I still haven't got my tree up. Honey, after we came back from shopping, Doorbell got the ringing, door got the knocking, the kids came over, the neighborhood kids. They played. Uh, first they was outside, then they migrated into my house, and they played, and then I ordered pizza um, on Saturday evening. And they stayed out there, y'all. My kid, the, the kids was just out there, like chilling, okay, chilling, eating a pizza, just having themselves a grand old good time. I love it. I love it. Um, and then I had to tell Halo, come on, because it was getting late. I don't like for her to be outside too late. I'm still old school when them street lights come on. Time to come home, okay? <laughs> so, um, then she came home, and then. Sunday morning, like me and Halo, we went, we went out again. I forgot what we went out for. Can't remember. But once we got back in that door, honey, the doorbell was ringing again. And her little friend came over. So, when the kids are over my house, um, I tend to just like to keep an eye on them. Uh, just to see what they doing, you know. Kids will be kids, look. Including mine, okay. And... A lot of the parents, they trust me. I know they do, um, and grandparents. So they trust that when they child come over here, just vice versa, if, if Hater was to go over to someone else's house, I would expect for that person to keep an eye on them. So I just keep an eye on them. They be in Halo room, they go outside. I don't be like up under them, but I be so focused to where I'm cleaning or something to where, doing something to where my focus is, you know what I'm saying, is not on these kids. So, and they be in and out the door. So I gotta make sure my front door <laughs> it's straight so yeah but nevertheless they have a good time that's all that matters you know and they ate they come eat snacks which i gotta go grocery shopping um again sometime this week. well i think i might go tomorrow because if i do any little cooking i'll have to decide by tuesday <laughs> but i just i'm still not in the mood but anyway we about to get up and go to see um wakanda i think today will be a perfect day to do it um it's monday some people are still back in work i know a lot of the schools are out but hopefully it won't be so crowded i think wakanda been out for maybe a week or two now i'm not sure i can't remember uh so we're gonna go today and go see wakanda and then later on this evening halo has karate practice y'all i am just i'm loving this taekwondo mom karate mom this new adventure that we going on simply because my baby love it and i just love to watch her learn the different techniques learn the different moves and just go at it it's just such a joy just to sit back and watch your kids you know for me it is um i also used to enjoy when sapri and Lushy what they was in they didn't do any like um activities like halo but they was in um the praise team like at church and i was one of those parents where i like to look at my child i like to look at my children like they used to always try to get the parents to get involved and i was like no <laughs> no it's the time for your kids to shine that's that's just me okay that's me in my opinion my way of thinking okay portia did not like not have us in no activity so i guess that's another reason why i felt like i didn't need to be up there dancing with children um <laughs> but now i just like to see my my kids flourish that's just me and so just sitting back watching halo flourish and all the other kids like they, they this place is so so warm it's more like a family they they when i first signed halo up they said it's more like a family here 
and I'm learning that it is because even the kids like when Halo had a trouble with her helmet um, like I asked one of the kids, let me see your thing. And he let me see it. I couldn't figure out. And so I told Halo to take it up to the, uh, the supervisor of the place. He said he couldn't do it. And so one of the parents was like, bring it here. I'll do it. So the guy, he put it on for me. And I thought that was sweet. But even when it, when it was time and Halo was putting her gear on, the little boy's like, okay, she doesn't need that right now. She needs this. I'm like, okay. He was so cute. I think his name is Sethin or Seth or something like that. But he always coming up to me and telling me what Halo needs to do. <laughs> You know, and I appreciate it, you know, and I get to talk to other parents there. So it is more like, you know, a, li a little family type of thing. Um, the place is real small. It's not real big. And I like that, you know. But anyway, so we're going to be going to karate later on today. Um, because we haven't been going in the past couple of days either, you all, because um, Halo wasn't... I want to say she wasn't feeling good. She was just sneezing a lot, and I don't want her taking her germs, spreading them all around. Uh, no, stay home. So she missed a couple of day, uh, classes. So I know she's going to be a little bit behind because she is supposed to be practicing for Orange Belt. Yes. And so hopefully she passed and get that orange belt but i hope she get that tough instructor today because i love him yeah i love this i can't i don't know his name but he's an older guy but he's good he's stern he's strict and i like him so i hope that halo gets him tonight because he's a beast he can make her be really really neat <laughs> at her technique okay so um i might just have to request some one-on-one -on -one training with him and um uh, and tell daddy to pay the extra dollar so we can make it happen but anyway yeah y'all so we're gonna um go see um wakanda today why y'all back back and um yeah we're gonna go from there oh y'all i thought that was somebody amazon i am i got a notification that amazon is a few steps a few steps <laughs> a few stops away and I'm trying to get the package before we go. Um, it's a really special package. Even though, I mean, all packages are special when you order them, right? But um, this one is something my baby asked for. And I think she will like it. I mean, I know she's going to like it because she asked for it. But it's something that most kids do not ask for. But I was shocked when she told me she wanted this. It was had to be like back in the summertime or maybe like March or May or something like that. But she was like, oh, mommy, I want a Bible. And she's like, but I, I know I have Bible. She had like the little first Bible um, as a kid. Her Nana gave her one and I also gave her one. Those are keepsakes, but she won an actual Bible. It used to be a christian bookstore um not too far from my house but they're no longer there so i went on amazon and ordered her a kid's bible that can break it down for her in such a way that she can hopefully understand um even as adults it's still hard to understand what the bible is saying but she asked for that and that's going to be one of her christmas gifts is a bible so i hope she cherish it i know i remember when i started going to church my grandmother was the one that gave me my first bible and usually grandparents are the ones that give you your first bible um so me giving her this and even though we don't go to church i hope it really 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 um means something to her and that she will pick it up um to learn more about learn more about jesus and how we should live so yeah i think that's gonna be like really really special i'm waiting for it to get here hopefully it'll get here before we leave that's what i'm hoping because it can still say like four stops and can take a whole five hours okay <laughs> so uh just don't know but um hopefully i'll get it before we leave Still waiting on Halo in the time to go, but I was sitting here at the dining room table, which I need to move this, y'all. Um, I know I post the video posted today uh, regarding like Halo need what person 
a comment that a person, a negative comment that a person left on my video. But I forgot to share with you guys that also with Halo having a good grade is because her teacher sent home with Halo uh, flashcards that she had in the classroom. She gave Halo, she had a bunch of, she had a paper full of just like timetables. She gave it to us. She would give it to the class. Um, so Halo has been, I make her practice on it, which I'm gonna go get some ink. I need to get some ink in my computer so she can keep practicing and I can just print it out. So I give her one of these sheets every day with her homework. Being that it's what fall break, I think it is they call it. They had another break, and I don't know what that one is. Um, I still do work with her, so we're gonna still be doing that. I just gotta figure out the time. Like, I woke up really, really late today, so she gave her this uh, flashcards. Oh, and this is the lady that she, I was telling y'all about that she told us to look up on YouTube. Um, Bloomy with Miss B. I know my handwriting is bad, but look up Bloomy with Miss B, and that'll help you uh, with the type of math that Halo does. That's like some new math that's going on, and she does break it down to help you understand. And with the help of that, her teacher and regular homework halo's been doing good she i like it that she come out oh i got it my mom like and i had to just go over and look at it but today i share with y'all that i had picked up these paragraph books so we're gonna do that oh that's where that is my little santa socks y'all i love these let me tell you i had got one is this the peel one enrich with no this is just high hot hydrating um, I had got one of these and um, it was a peel one. When I tell y'all, it peeled off all that dead skin on my feet. It took weeks, y'all, weeks, and the skin was still peeling. And I have never, um, okay, brush your teeth, baby. I have never had um, one of those things where you're, you, you soak your feet and one of these and it peels off the dead skin. So I need to get one of those because like Arizona, they call them like Arizona Hills. <laughs> you know, you have that dead skin and I'll be wanting that dead skin off my feet. Not only does it need to be scrubbed, it needs to be just like peeled off and start a new layer. So, but anyway, got this. I need the Santa mittens. So when I seen the little mittens, I got the little eye patch. This is all going into my I might just do a little stocking stuffer for me this year. Put it in my stocking stuffer. That's what I'm gonna do. Um, so yeah, but like I was saying, we're gonna go over this. So today, sometime today, we are going to be working working on synthesis here. So this one has synthesis and capitalization. Um, yes, Halo does have a problem when she does write out sentence with starting off with a capital letter. Uh -huh. She just started writing. So this one also has like punctuation and spelling. Um, so we'll be going over all of that this week. Um, I should have just planned it out like a, what do they call it? Like a, an agenda or something, but I didn't do that. But we're gonna have to tackle these things because I have, like I said, I have to stay up on her when it comes to that. But I really need to go get some ink for my printer you might as well just buy another printer literally because as much as ink costs you could have just got another printer for real <laughs> i hate it but i need to buy some more ink she's also going to do um still that one thing that her teacher gave her it's called extra math and it goes over multiplications with her no not multiplication but addition helping her memorize um addition it's not that she don't know how to add it's just the memory when you see it just come up with it so i'm gonna make her sit down and, and do that before we head out today then when we go to the movies i might pick up something i definitely want to go to kirkland's because it's this Christmas rug that I want to get doormat not rug um doormat that I want to get and I waited and I should have got it when it last week when I was supposed to go out and get it when it was ten dollars now it's twelve but 
they had like a little gingerbread house one but now they don't have it at the store so i think i'm just gonna since my colors is black and white i'm just gonna stick with a black one and see if i can pick that up today at kirkland's <clears throat> see if they have the little table settings to finish i need to decorate y'all yes and your girl have to get her um alani drink out because your girl was just lacking some energy so we're gonna probably do those today and then head to good old, okay karate practice um i think that's it for today though pretty much y'all so i hope y'all just enjoying um uh, these vlogs you know it's gonna be vlogmas i'm now i'm not gonna i'm gonna be honest i'm not saying that i'm gonna be vlogging every day as far as vlogmas no <laughs> i tried that one year and it is draining it's draining it puts a lot of stress on your computer your hard drive all of that minds wanted to shut down and be like hell for no what are you doing here we don't do this so um yeah i just i can't do that but i will vlog during the month of december um so you guys just stay tuned stay tuned make sure you turn on your post notification hit go ahead hit that post notification notification bell so you can be notified every single time i upload and definitely put all um press that like button go ahead press that like button i told y'all you know you love your girl <laughs> um and you know you love halo come here halo go like this and you know you love halo <laughs> my little sticker um so yeah go ahead and press and subscribe y'all we're going to i mean it's not nothing extravagant that we're going to be doing but definitely just come on this journey with us it's the season of just like i said make believe family all that good stuff and although you guys know i don't share my extended family because not everybody likes to be on camera and i don't choose to um put everybody on camera but to be honest because they didn't sign up for this you know what i'm saying um <clears throat> and my family likes their privacy so and, and i'm okay with that because i like mine okay i really do and, and, he, and you do you too and so and speaking of which like even now y'all i got somebody that's constantly trying to look up stuff i keep getting these notifications on my phone that somebody on facebook people that i know family on facebook like my nana they and i almost fell for it they sent me a um a thing and it uh like a message and it said that oh like my nana's name she's trying to send you some a picture from facebook and when i went to go click on it i was about to click on it because you know i talked to my nana and i'm thinking she wanted to show me something whether if it was church or something she's seen or something I, and i was about to click on it so i was like uh-uh and so i had took a screenshot over and sent it she's like girl i ain't seeing you nothing and they kept doing it so i kept deleting it then they went to a cousin y'all a cousin on my dad's side that she's just my cousin you know um and I'm like, I know y'all scamming. So people trying to find out stuff. And then my card, my bank card has been hacked. Um, so yeah, it's just that season of all this scammy shit, y'all. So just be on the up and up about everything. Like I have my my shit set to shit. If a five dollars go out, a dollar I need to know about it, honey. Um, but which I do keep up on my stuff like that. So that card is null and void which now i need to make sure i tell notify um all of my all of my people that i pay all of my different things that i pay that that card is null and void because like her payment for karate is going to be coming out and um I'll have to let them know you know what I'm saying so but anyway th this happens it seems like all the time but when you buy a lot of stuff online too that that hits you and when if you buy stuff online if you will be affected that way so just keep an eye on it if you have automatic payments coming out keep an eye on it because what this was was an automatic payment and it was through Amazon of some goddamn music and i don't even listen to no goddamn amazon music so it's like i know you a lie you a whole fucking lie so if i listen to music that's on pandora and that's fucking free so and 
only what they offer. I don't go through the extended version and all of that. So it's like, yeah. So y'all just be careful. Y'all be careful. Come on, baby. We got to do this extra homework, this extra math. How did they play that prodigygame.com? Okay, you can do that one too, but let's do this one because you know your teacher um sees this one and I don't think she sees the other one. So she can know that you are still doing work. Mm -hmm. Right? You know how to set it up. Don't make that face. Do your work. Uh-uh. Mine is not touch screen. Don't do that. <sighs> so while she's doing her homework, like she thinks just because um, it's fall break that she gets away from it. But no, not this mama here. We still... I still try, to, like I said, everything with her is routine. I have to keep up with her in routine. Otherwise, she scales back, and I don't want her to scale back. So, and we're going to do this one, too. Mm -hmm. So, yes, y'all. So, I'm going to let her seven do her work, and 15. I will talk to y'all later. Bye. Five Lazy Sunday mornings, hiding under covers I don't mind staying in with you Play a favorite movie, laying right beside me I don't mind when it's just us two The corner coffee shop we like to go Kate and I walks with you to take me home with Amazon packages here Good, now we can go, you ready to go? You? I want to see what this is. Uh, no, you don't. No, you don't. Put it down. Put it down. Make me glad to call you mine. And you have got my head in the clouds. One, two, three. All that I need is your body next to me. Okay, y'all. So we back. We made it back from the movies. The movie was really, really good really really excellent um it's truly what the title says it is wakanda forever shout out to my sis tina she was like girl no you got to go see it you have to see it because at first i was kind of skeptical if i wanted to see it because a reliable source here on youtube said it was trying to spin a totally different narrative i didn't see it that way i did not see it that way so y'all if you haven't seen Wakanda Forever, definitely go see it. It's truly, all I can say, it's going to truly stand by Wakanda Forever, okay? Um, great movie. Halo cried throughout the whole movie. I'm like, girl, shut up. <laughs> shut up. <laughs> She's like, mama, why you ain't crying? I said, because I'm not crying. I'm trying to look at the movie. She was crying. She was talking. I'm like, girl. She's at that stage. She's going to be one of those people that talk throughout the whole movie and I'm like Shut up. <laughs> I'm trying to listen I don't want to miss nothing because when we go to the movies I'm like do you got to go to the bathroom because I hate to get up I feel like every time you get up you miss something but oh that movie is so awesome love it love it love it um it makes you think I'm gonna tell y'all this it really it really made me think it really made me think about how we live in today a lot of these movies be telling you stuff and you don't really realize it until you pay attention to what's going on in the world so yeah it is it's a brain thinker it really is a brain thinker when you watch that movie like i said i highly recommend that movie um yes what kind of forever so we're back home um the little one is getting ready get ready to go to uh karate practice I'm gonna go do that. I'm all, I'm tired. I'm ready to get in my bed. My house is cold. I gotta turn my heater up. I think I might have turned it down. Yeah, cause in the mornings I turn it back down, cause I don't be wanting it that warm in the house. But now it's a little cold, so I'm gonna have to turn it back up before we leave. Y'all, you know, I think I need like a little electric blanket. <sighs> yeah, I need me an electric blanket. I need to buy me a whole new comforter set, cause somehow. Soda got spilled on my comforter and it just messed it all up. I thought the stain would come out, but it didn't. Um, I still can see it. It's noticeable to me because I know where it was at, but um, I ain't gonna do that now. Anyway, that's just totally off subject. So we about to go. We about to head out to karate. Um, 
Halo's karate practice. This karate mama. What should I say? Karate? Is it karate? It's taekwondo. So should it be taekwondo mama? Taekwondo mom? <laughs> I don't know. But they do so much stuff in there to where it's like, okay. I will give y'all a spoiler alert if y'all haven't seen it already, but not far as the movie, but um, what is it? Uh, Creed is supposed to be coming out with another movie. Definitely want to go see that. Got to, got to definitely see that because it look like it's going to be fun. Um, Michael B. Jordan, he starred in, you know, that movie. So, yeah, I, I'm going to have to see that. When Hay was like, oh, <laughs> she's like, mom, we got to see that. So, you know, that's what she's kind of like all into the little boxing and karate and all that type of stuff. So this is kind of like right up her alley. She's like I told y'all um, in a previous video, she she's changed. She's changing. She's going through that growth spur to where it's not always just about. Oh, y'all really trying to y'all somebody keep trying to message me on Facebook. They need to stop it. Knock it off. But anyway, um, she's going through that growth spur where it's not always just about fairy tales and Elsa no more. Even though I miss that little girl that used to love, love, love Elsa. If y'all been rocking me for a whole time, y'all know my baby used to love her some Elsa. The princesses. She used to want to have all the little princess dresses. And she had them all. Because <laughs> she loved pretend play, but... My baby is growing out of that. So, I don't know, y'all. I'm trying to grasp this whole new stage in her life. I really am. It's hard, but... Been through this before, but because I think it's because it's my last one. Even though my kids say it ain't. And I'll be like, the devil is a lie. <laughs> hey, it was my last one. Um, It's more... Ooh, it's just, it's just a totally different feeling that I'm just like... Stop growing up so fast. But let me quit rambling because, yeah, we need to get out of here. Um, and I need to get her water bottle and all that ready. Get her gear. Well, her gear is already ready. I just got to get her water bottle ready so we can head out the door. Oh, and go put her dog, Ziki, back in again. Okay. Hey, y'all. It's the next day and I'm up early this morning. Um, Open up my packages. Remember I told you guys yesterday that Halo requested a Bible. She wanted a Bible. Okay, y'all had to change my battery. But anyway, this is the Newt International Version um, Adventure Bible. It goes from ages 8 to 12. It says it has full color and um, it's a Bible for kids, you guys. So, this is the one I picked up for Miss Halo. Let me open it so you guys can kind of see what it looked like. Okay, y'all. They had different colors. Of course, I chose pink because I have a daughter and, and that's what it looks like. From on the outside, it has the contents, the Old Testament and the New Testament. Okay. And it looks just like a regular size, red, regular standard bottle Bible, but you know, just have some different um, questions and things for you to look up or go search um, to give you a better explanation of it. Look, they also had the Ten Commandments, pretty cool. I should have got her like a bookmarker, but it does come with one. So, I thought this was pretty neat. And I am going, it says how to use this Bible. So, pretty nice. Really, really nice. Um, so far, uh, like I said, I like the details and everything on it. Um, and hopefully, she will like it too. Because, like I said, she requested she asked to have one. She wanted her own. So I couldn't be more happy to be the one to give her her first real true Bible. But I decided to write in her Bible um, just so she can know. And then I wrote her name in there um, as well. But I thought this would be fitting for her 
because kids, even though we teach them, you know, you pray, you pray, you pray, and God will answer your prayer. But they need to also understand that even though you go through this book and you study it from front to back and you pray, you ask God, it's still up to him to give you the answer. Whether if he choose to give it to you or not, um, God knows every reason. But hopefully this Bible will, I know this Bible, let me say that, will give her better understanding. And as as she gets older, um, she'll understand more where her help come from. So, perfect gift for this Christmas. Uh, like I said, I, I'm so glad I'm able to give it to my daughter.